Thanks for checking this video out. Your mountaintop news video is coming up in just a minute. Did you know that it's going to be watched thousands of times, shared a bunch of times, likes, comments, you name it, it's going to be there. Why is it your ad here? Call me. Elderly widow struggles to sleep at night with the fear that her house may wash away. When it first happened, it was awful devastating. I got up that morning around 7 o'clock and it was, the uh, creek was a roaring real heavy. And I went out on the porch to check it out and I, it was coming up around this old camper I got sitting out here in the yard. She discovered that the floodwaters had washed away her back deck and feared that her home could be next. I went and uh, signed up with FEMA and several of FEMA's People came out and they checked around, took a few pictures and stuff. And I told them, you know, basically the same thing I'm telling you. And I was very concerned over my back because it ain't going to take much more to, uh, I'll get washed away here. She received a letter in the mail and was denied by FEMA. If a wall could be built behind her home, it would not only help her, but prevent the water from going to the neighboring homes. The last flood that come, it washed her deck and everything off the back, okay, back here in the back. This time it took out so much of the dirt up in front of her trailer. It still continued to do that right now, you know, doing that every time it rains. She's scared to death, can't sleep at night because of it. Every time it starts raising out there, I don't sleep. I just uh, walk the floor and stuff and ask the good Lord above and I thank him, uh, you know, for blessing it not to come over this time, but it got so high out there, I didn't know whether it was going to come or not. This lady needs help immediately. She needed help three months ago. And so I pray that somebody hears this or sees this that what can help with this to get her trailer blocked in before it gets put in the creek. Reporting for Mountain Tom News, I'm Ethan Miller.